Good day guys, today we're going to unbox a brand new EDC flashlight from a company called Security Ying. And as you can see, the box is very basic with the sticker, barcode, and label. So let's open this one up and let's see what's inside. Okay, there, so there's your flashlight. And there are some accessories included. So let's check this one out. Okay, so it has a lanyard and a type C. Oh, let's discard this one first. And a type C cable right there. Okay, so let's uh, check this flashlight out. Okay, so this flashlight is made of an aluminum body. And it's an aircraft grade aluminum with a side switch, and there's no tail switch or magnet uh, at the bottom. And then uh, there's like three SSD20 LEDs, so that's our main emitter for this flashlight. This unit is waterproof with a rating of IPX6, and this is also drop proof for like 1.5 meters. So this was a very durable flashlight right there. And then uh, let's talk about uh, the battery. So the manual said it has a built-in battery, but I think there's none because it's too light so let's uh, open this guy up I'm gonna show you that uh, there's no included battery right there so I'm gonna take my 21700 battery to test this so right now I'm gonna use my Enoch battery so let's install this one okay so so I just want to mention that this guy has a 1500 lumens for power and then the distance or the beam distance is around 200 to 500 meters and this one has like uh, three modes low medium high plus strobe and an SOS the increments of the lumen uh, is not indicated on in the manual but I'm gonna I mean I'm gonna show it to you later on okay so let's try this one out to turn on you just need to press the side switch to turn this one on right there and then uh, if you're gonna change the modes, you just need to hold it for 1.5 seconds so that it will change the light mode. So I'm gonna show it to you. Right there, press, press once, turn it on, and then hold it for like 1.5 seconds to change the modes. Medium, low, and then it's off. Like that. To activate the strobe, just need to double click the side switch right there. And then to turn to or to activate the SOS mode, just need to double click again. But honestly, I forgot to do it on this part of the video, but I'm going to show it to you when I do the beam shot. Also, just want to indicate that there's a battery level indicator uh, for this flashlight. So when you turn it on, there's a green color. So when the light is green, it means uh, you're more than 30%. When it turns red, it means you're low battery. I mean, you may need to charge your batteries and also for the runtime just want to point out that the metal said that uh, on the highest mode this will last at about three hours so that's 1500 lumens and at the lowest mode uh, it lasts about 18 hours but basically that depends on what type of battery you're using so if you have like uh, 5000 milliampers versus 4800 probably there's a slight difference on the runtime also, uh, when this one, uh, I mean, the battery gets low, there's a Type-C charging port in the back. So you don't need to get your charger. You may charge it here directly. That's why there's a Type-C cable included uh, on the box. So this one will make it more convenient for you. So you don't need to bring uh, your external charger. Just bring your cell phone charger and you're good to go. So that's basically the basic function of this flashlight. So. Let's get out and then uh, let's do some beam shot of this bad boy.